Hello all you awesome people out there, my name is Kedu and welcome back to this let's play of Life is Strange Where we completed um, episode 2 last time and that means we are jumping into episode 3 now With this Chaos Theory Um yeah Please, let me in So in the previous episodes of Life is Strange. Whoa! We called film Little Pieces of Time. Because Max wants everybody to see I'm so sick of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! It totally makes sense. You hell saved my life. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, Stelma and Louise, you're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. <laughs> What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Okay, then we got the recap. <coughs> Sorry about that. So... Can I... Play now, please? That would be kind of nice of you. And there we go. It's kind of quiet. I don't like quiet. Please. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's see what this episode brings. Hopefully not any more death. I think there's been enough of that. Kate! Chloe would be all over this, so I better get moving. Okay, um. I still can't stop thinking about Kate. It's like I'm awake in a bad dream. Yep. Okay, so I can only look. I have to feed the rats. Are you a hungry bunny? Here, nosh on this. I don't want that to die. Whose rabbit is it, actually? Hey, Bunny. Don't be too bummed, but from now on, I'm your new mommy. Yeah, I thought so. It's Kate's. Anyways, let's... Come on, Max. No more tears. You have to act, not react. Well, let's leave then. So I can meet up with... 
Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... Flashlight. And that's why you have a mobile phone. <laughs> This is my prayer for you, Kate. Bless your gentle soul. <sighs> I wish I could save her, but yeah. Hey, Dana. How are you doing? I just can't stop thinking about Kate. And if this is my fault, too. I think we're all responsible for what happened. Not you, Max. You were close to her. It doesn't matter now. Kate's dead. Tell that to Victoria and the Vortex Club. Dana... There's more to this than just Victoria and the Vortex Club being mean. So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan being expelled? I'm not sure yet, but I'm on it. Weird shit is going down at Blackwell, and I'm going to find out why. I'm getting scared now, but people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. Ah, oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. That actually... Yeah, where was... I have no idea where Victoria's room is. Uh, there we go. So if she isn't here today... Then I have a good chance to check that out. Let's see if I can find anything. Since I've crossed the line from Snoop to Detective, I might as well search for clues about what really happened to Kate at the Vortex Club party. These socks cost more than my wardrobe. <laughs> yep. I'll title this one Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Mm, gotta find anything else. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. <laughs> Why so many sarcastics? That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Well, well. Maybe Victoria isn't a monster after all. like a thread for sociopaths. Max Crackfield? Lame. Party on, dudes. So, was there anything else? First Rachel and now Kate? This is the end of the Vortex Club. Or is it? <laughs> a unique point of view is right. Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Hmm. Nothing. Yeah. Victoria is about as straight as me. But she really appreciates style. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the chase space. Color me impressed. Hmm. Hmm. Then it doesn't seem like there's anything else in here. Well, I hope this helped me a little, though. 
<coughs> Sorry. My throat is a little sore today. But... Then I at least know that Victoria was at the party and she doesn't look... Did not look that good. So... Let's get out of here. Oh, so nice. Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. And the main hall was... Jesus. I still can't believe she jumped. No, I don't have time to sit on the bench. So, the main hall must be the school building. Principal Wells, are you serious? I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. Um, how do I get past him? Look at I still don't think this helped me. <laughs> I'm cheating. What the hell am I doing out here? Kate is dead and I'm sneaking around. Yeah? This campus looks like a cemetery. Okay, there must be... What not, Chloe? I am kind of working on it. Um, yeah. So anything over here? What was that? Hmm, nothing. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's unlocked. I hope Samuel isn't around. Nuts and bolts. <laughs> like my grandpa's garage. <laughs> uh, as Yoshi would say. Who knew Samuel was so into runway fashion? Um, that doesn't hit me at all. Nothing here. Nothing but tools. Yeah, that I know. I can't use any of the things you were giving me in here good dang it uh, I wasn't supposed to get past him then um, I can't get over there squirrel 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 um, what's up with that tree Why is there a squirrel if I can't use it for anything? That sounded wrong. Uh... The Chibanka does look pretty scary at night. Please don't destroy me. Oh, right. Oh, the most magical insects. Burn bright. I'm sure they will. Miss Caulfield, you have to be stealthier than that. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I, I'm still upset about Kate. I needed some air and space to walk. I'm sorry you had to go through that today. You tried to help, but God damn it, Blackwell is my responsibility. And I... I let her and Kate down. Go on back inside. Get some rest. 
It's been a shitty day. Good night, Max. Great. So how do I get past him to meet Chloe? Yeah, that's my fault exactly too. Um, I'm pretty sure I have to get the power down somehow from that. Um, but the only way I can think about that is if there's something in the shit I can use. Uh, this is gonna take some time. I'm pretty sure it, there must be something in here. Uh, but there's nothing new to play around with. Dead. I know Samuel doesn't wear silky scarves. So, who does? Um, there's nothing in here at all. Maybe I can use the squirrel. <laughs> I have no idea. Squirrel? Nope. I don't think I can go back inside. No, I have to do it from outside here somehow. <sighs> what now, Chloe? I'm working on it. Max, stop wandering outside and get back to your dorm. <sighs> now he's got me totally trapped. That smart son of a bitch has me trapped. Yeah, I know that. I think. Um, uh, the only thing I can think of is if I can take the power somehow uh, from that. That's my way to say I have no idea how to do it. Set of keys on me somewhere. Ah, gotcha. Now, why won't they fit? Max the ninja strikes again. So that's how I did it. <laughs> God dang it, I'm an idiot. Oops. Sorry about the noise, but I have to make another sitting position. And hopefully, don't <laughs> break anything <laughs> in the process. Okay. Booyah! Why is this grumpy in Booyah. this game? Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary and sensitive asshole. Chloe, I watched my friend jump off a roof today. I don't think you need to prank me tonight. You always trip out on me for not being there for you, but 
Is this how you're there for me? I'm... I'm sorry, Max. I, I wasn't even thinking. I suck. I'm not trying to be a bitch, but... I'll never get the image out of my head of Kate jumping off that roof. All because my power didn't work. It didn't mean shit. I know seeing Kate fall was horrible. I don't even know how to deal with that, so I just... act like an idiot. But it's your badass power that's gonna bring all this to a close. We just need to connect the players. And find out who really killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Not just them. Yep. I just want to beat the shit out of those particular bros. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Dead? I'm sorry. I hate even saying that, Chloe. Not as much as I hate thinking it. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just... I don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I imagine uh, you're pretty upset over Kate as well. I'm, like, still in shock. I've never seen anybody die. I really cared about Katie. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well... How does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... God dang it. Are you fucking kidding me? It's so stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out.
Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. Joking. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? They can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. Tell that to Kate. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. But we will look at this the next time. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can hit me up on Facebook or Twitter or write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more awesome videos and I hope you all will have an awesome day. So until next time. Farewell. Mm -hmm.